AA and NA meetings are held on the hour all across the state, a safe haven for those in recovery from drugs and alcohol. Many credit these 12 step meetings for their continued sobriety. But with coronavirus concerns, a lot of people have reached out to me worried they'll no longer have a place to go. Since 1982, the Wolf Street Foundation in downtown Little Rock has been a central meeting place for those in recovery. But starting today, the nonprofit is making some big changes. We did have our last meeting here with 50 plus people uh, just this past couple of days. Due to coronavirus concerns, all meetings at the 10th and Louisiana location will be suspended until further notice. However, Executive Director Vicki Seaman Morgan says she wants to make it clear there is still help available for those who need it. We can offer peer recovery specialists who will be available here to do one-on-ones. If they don't have that interest but would like to meet with their personal sponsor or a group of three or less, we're going to allow them to come here, sit in a space uh, where they can sit at a distance from each other and have that meeting. Down the road at Recovery Central on Markham Street, meetings will continue, but precautions will be taken. People need to go to meetings and it can literally be life-saving at times. Former board member of Friends of Recovery, Tom Barron, says they're keeping meetings smaller and the chairs spaced apart. Some of the night meetings are, you know, have 70, 80, 100 people. And we just can't, and we may not be able to accommodate all those people right now. He says to help stop the spread of the virus, rooms are deep cleaned after each use and plenty of hand sanitizer is available. But touching is off limits. Hugging is a big part of what they do in the NA meetings, and we're saying no hugging right now. And we close, every, every meeting is closed with a prayer, with arms around each other. People to stay in their seats and doing their prayer now. Virtual or online meetings are being recommended to avoid spreading germs. That's what we're suggesting is people either, you know, do a FaceTime meeting or a Skype meeting or join an online meeting. Necessary steps to keep recovery going. And for those meeting places that are staying open, the Arkansas Central Office of Alcoholics Anonymous has some tips. Place some wipes by the coffee pot, eliminate all community food, place the contribution basket in a common area, create a safety statement, look into setting up electronic group contributions, and make sure you wash your hands and don't touch your face. I also took a look at some of those online meetings, and I have a link for you right now on THV11.com. Help is always available. That's the message they want to get across. Even though they can't meet in public, some of these groups, there is still always someone that's available when you need them. Rob.